Hello everyone, my name is JRBR and welcome to The Game That Never Was. Wish I had more time for Game Dev Edition. <laughs> um, it's a tell a story. It was part of the Tell a Story Game Jam. And it's made by Black Dragon BE. And I'm not really sure, it doesn't really describe what the game's supposed to be. But I just really liked how cute and dorky this little guy is. It's just bobbing back and forth. Let's begin. Okay. Uh, talk. Tell it. Legend says this world was supposed to be quite interesting. Oh. Is this all it's gonna be? Old lever. Okay, what? This thing here? No idea what it does. Never put. Alright. I like to open this gate. Leave me alone, I'm taking a peek. <laughs> so I'm guessing this game is just going to be kind of like if video game characters were honest. Gate Halo. Can you believe this? A gate to prevent us from simply walking to the other side. Yeah, well, it's open now. Strawberries. You can move around using WSD, the other keys, left arrow stick, or the D pad. Yep. And so then I had to walk to him to figure that out. What do you got to say? Oh, come on. Welcome to the green side. Good, good. What's in your house? For some reason, I get the feeling I was put in here just to fill in some space. Aren't we all? Let's see, where are you? Some cemetery? Grim. Here are my failed game fighters and prototypes. Please take a moment of silence and respect our fallen comrades. My brother's kind of pessimist about it. I think these graves represent knowledge. Think about it. You really use these fail fighters to learn about new concepts, which will spawn new food games. I can only hope we two can prove a help to the creator. Okay, so they have multiple things. Some of the poor things were killed off only a few days after their birth. These graves now look the same, but each one stands for a unique game. Now you then? Things. Right. Here lies an all mine card bagman. I was stated to play me as a blast, the developer's interest did not last. They rescued me by being out to take pictures of me. Future Creep is a sneaky fellow that ruins dreams and drowns kings. Sweet dreams, 2D road life. Math is complicated. Making math fun and challenging is even more complicated. Okay, but as a lone hobbyist game developer, ha. Huh. Split screen ARPG. Need something soon for you, but last year too much to handle. DLC. The game. You sound like so much fun on paper. Why did you let everyone down when on the screen? Catching butterflies in the video. Game of Hobbit Islands, eh? Game and net physics right nay. Alright, these are all, these should all still be the same, right? I don't know why I'm having trouble with him now. Yeah. Do you have something new to say, maybe? Oh, they're having a bad textures. I came here to play a big part in the world. Good, good. Then we all. Decided to stand here overlooking the gate. This thing doesn't even have windows for God's sake. We're searching for something to actually do in the same thing, Father. Alright. Good, good. Let's see, do you guys have anything new to say? What happens if I keep bothering the guy trying to pee? Leave me alone, I'm taking a pee. Leave me alone, I'm taking a pee. I can't believe he didn't get any angrier after that. Is this person living in an igloo? I wish I had more time to figure out decide this was going to What about you? Two groups of people with separate lives and hated each other. Are you part of them? They each thought the other group had locked them up for various reasons. However, no one remembered who or what separate they were. We had a single brave and living guy discovered that the two groups weren't that different after all. The elusive area between the groups of beautiful friendships were forged. 
Oh well, who cares, right? Is that what I'm doing here? Use E or space when the control lines interact with people and objects. Press escape to return timer screen. Are you showing like force quit, right? I'm hungry. Alright. Again, so many of these characters just relate to how I feel right now. That's just lazy game design. I bet there's even some stupid unoriginal mode out there. Game developers who skips. Really? Alright. So I talked to everyone. Uh, as many times as they would have changed except this person, which I didn't realize was the last one. This game needs some babes. Why aren't there any women here? Seriously, in this day and age, the least you expect of a is to at least include a hot girl. We don't even have a PC or some magazines here, so why well, give for a piece of beep right now? Er, censored. Oh, yeah, I'm censored. Turkey baster might be a bit much though, I guess. His name's Ebert. Ebert the Perfect. Um So does anyone have anything new to tell me? Yep, I'm thinking this is about it. Can I kill myself? Can I jump off the ledge? Maybe we're better off. Can I close the gate? Close the gate? No. Alright, we'll see. Nothing else to do. Return to the yep, turn title screen. Yeah, so this has been the game that never was. Interesting. Had potential. I'm guessing we need more time for game dev. I don't know. But <laughs> well, it's kinda of funny. Mostly dumb funny, but that can happen. I mean I guess we need two stones this is like sixth, seventh game, something I know. But either way, there'll be a link down in the description below if you think there's something here I missed. Go off, you're more than welcome to go off and play it for yourself. Otherwise, there's a video on the left side of your screen, which is a video YouTube thinks you'll like, and a video on the right side, which is the last video that I upload. Or you can click my icon in the middle to subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!